Sorry, somebody's sitting there. Who? My physics ball trophy. <laughs> That trophy is meaningless. I forfeited, therefore you did not win. I know someone who would disagree. Who? My physics ball trophy! <laughs> Leonard is so smart. Sheldon who? All right, that is very immature. You're right, I'm sorry. I'm not! <laughs> okay, new contest. What are you doing? I am settling once and for all who is the smartest around here. Okay? Are you ready? Absolutely. Bring it on. Okay. Marsha, Jan, and Cindy were the three daughters in what TV family? <laughs> the Brady Bunch. Okay. <laughs> Sammy Hagar replaced David Lee Roth as the lead singer in what group? The Brady Bunch? Van Halen. All right, Madonna was married to this Ridgemont High alum. Oh my God, Sean Penn! How do you know these things? I go outside and I talk to people. Okay, here. What actor holds the record for being named People Magazine's Sexiest Man Alive? William Shatner. Wait. I don't think it's Shatner. Then it's gotta be Patrick Stewart. No. Formal protest. <laughs> All right, singer who sang Oops, I Did It Again? <laughs> okay. Tweety Bird taught he taught a what? Romulan. <laughs> yes. He taught, he taught a Romulan. <laughs> it worked. It really worked. They said I was mad, but it worked. <laughs> oh, no, not Morlocks. Not fleshy, they Morlocks. <laughs> Sheldon, are you okay? We have to get rid of the time machine. It is a little big for the living room, isn't it? Yeah, that's the problem. It's too big. I'm glad you agree. I hired some guys to help us move it. Come on in, fellas. Oh, no. More luck. Eat him. Eat him. Ah! Yeah. Thank you. I appreciate. 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 Uh-oh. Oh, honey, is your medication wearing off? Well, hi, cutie pie. I was hoping you'd show up. dog who made a noise like that. Had to put him down. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Come on in. Thank you. You look very nice. Thank you. So do you. <laughs> <laughs> 
I made an eight o'clock reservation. Okay, yeah, great. Listen, um, maybe we should talk first. Okay. But before you say anything, have you ever heard of Schrodinger's cat? Actually, I've heard far too much about Schrodinger's cat. Good. All right, the cat's alive. Let's go to dinner. BT Zainar. BT. Crazy man. Call the police. You know, booby die get to Shuguan. BT Zainar. Man, you're watch one, Sean. I'm dog, man, yo. Hi. Yeah, hi, listen. I know what's been bothering you about us, and I have the answer. What are you talking about? Okay, first, I want to say that it's not Sheldon's fault. He tried very hard to keep your secret. If Howard hadn't drugged him, he would have taken it to his grave. <laughs> he told you? Yes, but it's okay. Now that we know what the problem is, there's a simple solution. Pasadena City College? A place for fun, a place for knowledge. <laughs> See, this man here is playing hacky sack, and this girl's going to be a paralegal. <laughs> I get it, because Dr. Leonard Hofstetter can't date a girl without a fancy college degree. Well, it's really not that fancy. It's just a city college. Right, but I have to have some sort of degree to date you. That doesn't matter to me at all. So it's fine with you if I'm not smart. Absolutely. <laughs> OK, this time I know where I went wrong. Uh, bite me! <laughs> Captain, I'm getting an unusual reading. Yeah, that's great. You guys want corn dogs? Yeah. <laughs> that's a temporal anomaly. Corn dogs didn't come into existence till the first half of the 20th century. <laughs> Anyway, Lisa, I just wanted to tell you again how much I enjoyed the other night. And again, I'm sorry for how it ended. <laughs> but again, if you could let me know about Friday, my mother needs a head count so she can know how big a brisket to get. Howard, Howard, look at this. Anyway, call me. It's Howard. It's unclear how the Mars rover got into the crevice, but one thing's certain. The data which it has sent back contain the first clear indications that there may have been life on Mars. <laughs> it's a scientific discovery that has staggering implications for all mankind. Unfortunately, we'll never know who's responsible. Son of a bitch.